American business, and uh, that's exactly what we're trying to do here in Florida. Personally, I, you know, I, I got a, I got a lot of um, experience in China. You know, it, uh, it showed me how you know Peter wants this team to work and uh, how he wants obviously the whole team to, to play together and and have the the same goal, which is to win. Uh, just to experience a new country that you know the Olympics will be held in. You know, I think it, it was a valuable experience for the team. You know, being there and and seeing the culture and kind of what to expect with hotels and you know stadiums and travel, etc. So, you know, that was good. And then also to play in front of uh, you know in some big stadiums, some big crowds, and uh, some good competition. It really helped us come together as a team and uh, kind of just you know learn what it's going to be like in uh, in the summer in Beijing. I think it was a good trip because it gave the guys a you know a glance of what kind of style and system the coaches wanted to play and um, gave the team a good chance to bond and really get to know each other and fill each other out. You know, Peter put some confidence in me that, that I could be the leader of the team and, and, and captain the team through the two games and I think it was an important role for the team and you know, I think we did a pretty good job of, of doing some things that we had set out to do when we uh, started out training together in the way we wanted to play so it was, uh, it was exciting for me to, to try to be a leader and you know, try to, try to just, you know, be a guy on the field that guys could, could look to, you know, in a, in a tough time. So I think we did an okay job of doing that. Look at, look at the distance right now. It's our, our second or third camp and uh, you know we kind of feel as though we're uh, you know we're, we're leaders with this group uh, not just myself and Arturo but Sasha and Mo and, and Dax and, and uh, some of the guys that are playing regular in the MLS and uh, we've got a lot of college guys and a lot of younger guys coming into these camps and you know and uh, coach Novak doesn't want to have to reiterate the rules and the, the things that go along with this team every camp so he looks to us and you know to, to kind of impose those upon the, the younger guys and and also to be leaders on the field because you know we've uh, we've had some valuable minutes this year in MLS and uh, that's going to help us in this experience going towards the Olympics. I've been in the, in the, in the first two camps with this team and uh, you know I've talked to Peter and you know he he looks at me like a, like a leader and you know I think uh, I can easily pass down to, to the guys that you know that are first timers in this camp and also you know the college kids that come in. Um, so like that kind of Peter doesn't have to go through that all over again, you know. And uh, he expects you know the players that have been here to pass that on to the to the new kids, and so it could be just a smooth transition for everybody. On and off the field, you know, we try to be good pros and you know you know make sure we're on time to meetings or you know we're we're explaining the right things and, and doing the right things in, in everything that we do as a team. I think the more we play together and get used to each other, the better off we'll be. You know, it takes time to really get to fill each other out and know each other's styles of play coming from different teams. With this group, we've had four games and we've got four ties, I think. So, you know, it'd be nice to get a win because we've had leads in a, in a couple of those games and, you know, just to learn how to, you know, to bunker in at the end and, and uh, you know, to get that last, that last 10 minutes to keep the other team out, you know, is to get the win because three points is a lot better than one. And uh, come the summer and come qualifying, we're going to have to win games. and. So it'd be, it's a, it'd be good for this group to you know to learn that. We had a 3-0 lead in the second game, and you know we end up tying at 3-3. And other than that, you know we've really set out. You know we've said that there's a way we want to play, and you know we've been playing that way. So it's good that guys are responding and, and reacting to the way that we want to play. And you know hopefully when it comes to, to qualifying, we finish our chances and you know we win.